Okay, good morning YouTubers. Welcome to BMW Programming and Coding channel on YouTube. Okay, today we're working on a BMW F10. Oh no, F30. And we have programming aboard with the uh, Ed Unit Basic. As you can see, our IP address is 192.168. The network path that is inside the Ed Unit is started with the IP address of 192. So therefore, we have to connect ICOM on the laptop to the uh, internet modem so that the DSTP server in the modem can distribute the IP address for the ICOM on the laptop on the network. And then we we'll go here. And there we go. Here, boom. Good morning, YouTubers. Yeah, not, oh, not that good, not that good. We are looking at visa configuration data could not be read here. We have roughly uh, six twelve codes and uh, we have, oh, that's in German. I don't know what that means. Instrument panel message for condition-based service and then no communication possible with the head unit. We're coming aboard in the head unit. All right, so we're going to see if we can do a, uh, a software update here. Let us carefully measure plan. As you can see, the actual high level is of 2019, uh, 07 July, 530, and then we have latest high level target in East study as 2020 of March 03, and the software version of that high level target is 540. All right, so we're going to try to restore this far, the unit. All right, so let us see if we can execute the measure plan here. All right, we should go to, to right here, we should go check for CD. In DVD USB, right there in the car, so we go first. Let's start to click continue. Let's just make sure that there's no card running over there, and the window is okay. Door is closed, blah blah blah. All right, this is remaining one minute. We have to go here, service plan, we go here, programming plan. Let us see if we're gonna perform a gateway measure, repair measure. Let's hope we do it successfully. All right. Um, yeah, I'm gonna try that as well. It failed. Programming in history it failed. Inside. Didn't have a key inside. Yeah. It failed. But I, I log in on the it, um, I log in on the BMW um, online. It's the data that I can use to revive it. I'm doing a DME in programming work. One other guy, it failed as well. Both online and offline. So I do not know if the if the unit is gonna be able to be replaced. So, uh, yes, sir. So, oh, damn. It's working now. Yeah, I feel it, yeah. Yeah, the head unit is taking the file. It's taking the file now. It is it's making a progress. It Start the progress of writing to it. First, it showed me a red X that it failed. It showed me right here. Yeah. First, that it failed. But now it shows a progress bar. So, I guess we get the network right. Yeah, just hope we flush it and restore it and we're good to go. Alright, wait. Yeah, if we're going more than one time, it's another 12 minutes live and up again. Okay. 
Okay. So you would recommend programming over the network instead of straight, right? Yeah, I would like to program. If I have my car, I program over in the morning. I program over the morning. So maybe I should leave it that way. But I don't do mobile. Right? If I'm doing mobile, I'm walking with dark and logic. Yeah. Let me tell you what before. Never? I've never had a feeling like that before. Okay, well, on some cars, when you're doing an update on it, it will write the file. It will update the NBC. I've right. done it before. I never, I updated the NBC before, NBC updated it. Right. And it never went programming the board. And I never connected to the modem. Right, that's how it usually goes through the video. Um, I don't know. Why well, fail on you? You throw the battery, hold it on about 30? You mean on the car? Always, man. As a car pull in here, get that charge of the battery. Where are you going to now? Yeah, it went through now. It's a brief test in my home. The radio moving. The coding fail, see that? Field. Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna inject it with it. I can inject the code inside inside of it. Right. Oh, oh, no, no, no. It, no, no, look, yeah, 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 yeah. Just come here. Just come up. Flash on the screen too. Yeah, just come up. All right, let me go. Let me go here. So we have to use anything else. Take this cable off. We put up a yellow one, and we can use the yellow one for the high form. Keep that connected there. And then we use the laptop. And then the 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 laptop. Just go to the laptop, and then the icon, the icon goes straight to the, 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 yeah, but you can keep going directly in that way. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Here's what I want to do. I don't know if you've Right now, when I have this off, I'm busy. It's really manual too. When I turn it up, I'm going right. high. So I feel okay, like so it's jumping high. So you can see replace this. Give the part number done. Yeah. All right, so well. now, let's go ahead and we'll we'll program it off. Alright, so metro plan here completed. So we're gonna we're gonna look here and um, we said these are the follow-up operations to be done. So we're gonna we're gonna perform these operations now. We're gonna execute measure plan here. Performing these follow-up operations here. I don't know if I put that with him get mad. No, man. No, there's a copy in one year. Yeah. 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 Right up high level, vehicle profile, high level, copper, blah, blah, blah. All right, it says right here. Alright, so far so good. Metro plan completed successfully. So we're gonna um it'll be a delete form and we're gonna go back here, we come on the you can see no control units that here to be updated. Alright, we go here and here's it here. See that? All green, there it goes. Or MBT Ed unit basic. See that? Oh good, there you go. Down here, initialize there's something going wrong. Can we undo that? 
I'll repeat. If something goes wrong after the initialization of the spec space, is there a way to undo the spec? Undo the initialization the or no? No, the flip spray just only distinct the clock of the DME and the DGM. It takes the clock to the ICM, the bigger the shutdown or the DMP. The out, the flip spray down, ECS on it, ICM, DMP. And do you say the, the drive in here itself, the, um, the cameras and stuff is on flip spray? Yeah, I come when you have flip spray. Yeah, yeah. I come and take out when you have flip spray. They all take out, they all take that these is one of the cars, DME, DSP, ICM, ECS, on the DGM. Because your internal clock, there were on different whatever, yeah. but they think in terms of the timing. So flip spray synchronize the timing. Yeah. Of their different individual clocks, so that they all transmit their messages in the same time frame. Yeah. 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 Um, what is it? Crash that is a safety module, would it be on that too? Uh, repeat? The SRS module. SRS crash safety module is not on all right, the only reason I asked that three things that we had the other day. All right, the next three been done successfully. That was also the same thing as the airbag. Yeah. So then, if that's the case, then if we know the IC and has to be on flex rate, that would make sense to me. Really I see wrong. Yeah. So that's the reason I asked. Yeah, what do you say? Come again with the question, man. You said the ones that have to be on flex rate yeah. is DSC, yeah. ABS. Well, DSC is ABS. Yeah. DSC, central gateway, yeah. um, transmission. No. Transmission? Yeah, yeah. it's on flex rate, but it's not required for engine to start. Okay. But engine, if, 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 there's no, if you replace an FEM and a VEC new, or if you stop one and you like you virginize it and you write over the the, the VCL ID to it and right. VCL order and stuff. If you don't want to go inside there, you have to do two things. Uh, you have to do. You have to do the starter reset. You have to, you have to do the starter reset block, starter lock reset, and then you have to do um flex The flex And then that's it. It's the start. So once the DSC is communicated with the ICM or the DMU with the ICM, okay. or the DSC back and forth. If one of them is not responding. Okay, it's not gonna start. Okay, the flex ray is gonna fail. Okay. That's all communication with the DSP and ICM through them, and it will start. If, if, if you get flex ray uh, successfully initialized, mm -hmm. this will start. Yeah. If the DGM code is All right, there you go. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. So yes everything now is in green. You see that? And initialized software, everything is good. Everything is in green, everything is in green. Everybody's okay. It's only the one part that will remain, the SAE. Uh, they call it the initial yeah, yeah, the the yeah, you have to put it to sleep and wake it up. That's a new yeah. code. I never used to have that before. That's only yeah, started yeah. happening over the past last two or three. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, YouTubers. Okay, YouTubers, end of this video. The head unit basic has been programming and coded. Here is the software flash on it. So we're going to hang up now and go. I am out. Bye. Boom. Alright, that is it.